Hey everyone, it's Rost. Uh, pretty low effort video today with very little editing. It's going to be a match between Jinzo and Tonic and myself, or rather Jinzo and Tonic and myself will be forming one side of the perspective and then our opponent is Lucas who is going to be taking the other side of the perspective. Um, so we're essentially showing the same game twice but different perspectives. Um, the only issue really we have right now is that the game was pretty lackluster. So this is kind of more of an experiment um, and we will see if we do more of these in the future. Uh, hopefully uh, with better games and perhaps different people as well. Enjoy. Okay, fine. Simple strategy. Summon the monster, set a trap, enter. <laughs> Let's go. All right, well, I, I don't even know if I have a Chaos Warrior deck. Like, I have Geist D's one, but that's, like, really... Nah, fuck that. Well, we can just use the um, Dale, Dale deck. The Dale deck? Yeah. I don't have the Dale deck. You do have the Dale deck. You do and, I? You and um... <sighs> Charles was using it. When? <laughs> <laughs> okay, not the deal deck. Uh, wait, hang on. Uh, oh, right. I'm going to just use standard goat control. I've got, <laughs> I've, I've got uh, James James Arcs Warrior from cool. Obelisk One, which is uh, three Blade Knight, three Kaiko in the main deck. Yeah, understood. Okay, Why not? Yeah, fine. We'll just use that then. All right, let's join up. I started recording, by the way. <laughs> no worries. Like ages ago. Um, cool. I might tag him. Oh no, he's realised. Okay. Are you watching? <laughs> I am. Um, are you not going to share your screen? Uh, oh my could Yeah, no. Actually, that makes more sense, doesn't it? Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. I'm sharing my screen. Cool. And I've won the uh, rock, paper, scissors. Nice. Oh, I've got Icon Ash watching us already. Um, oh, yeah. oh, I haven't played Warriors in forever. I know it well. I'm just going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, we can't play We're going to start with Pot of Greed. <laughs> so I would... I would... Uh, he even cage summon, me. I would summon the... Blade Knight, set Ooh. a Dust Tornado and set a Judgment. Or even just set the um, Tornado. Say. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going with. Uh, yeah. Oh god, I've got feedback to the sound effects of your dueling book. Like, oh. How is that even possible? Because I've got mine muted and all I'm doing is sharing my screen. Oh no, wait, you're now watching. I'm watching. <sighs> I'm going to try and reduce the feedback as much as possible, but mm. there's definitely going to be some... Oh, okay. <laughs> it's fine. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah just try it. One thing I've noticed Ooh. about you is that you love... Oh, here we go. <laughs> you love to um, destroy the magic and trap cards straight away. Oh, yeah. All right. It's. I don't know why. I just love doing it. Um, I would... <laughs> I want to be greedy here. I want a normal summon... Um, the Don judgment yeah. sit both the judgments and then snatch deal that thing and just hit him fucking hard. <laughs> Let's just go. Uh, okay. Yeah, that is quite greedy. It's greedy. I'm very keen, dude. I'm super keen because you got two judgments. Like, what yeah. is he gonna do? <laughs> you just got one massive no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should have set the reinforcements to hit him with two K, but that's fine. Oh yeah. Well. Damn. Um, <laughs> Uh, Don's effect. Don's effect. Yeah. Cool. Nice. He's also playing Warrior. Okay. Oh, great. A, a Warrior mirror match. Do you know what? I'm going to set yeah. it now, anyway. I missed out. If, if, I, if there's ever a point where I lose out on, uh, um, f you know, if I lose with 300 life points left or whatever, I'm going to be kicking myself. <laughs> but, uh, I don't see him being able to come back from this. Nah, neither. I mean, he can't, right? Mm-mm. What, what combination of cards could he have? What's... Oh, well, he's got a Kaiku. 
Okay. You just knowing that Kaiku, one hundred percent know that. Just yeah. get rid yeah, of yeah, the judgments. Yeah, okay. Uh, we'll, um... Yeah, just know that. Yeah. Okay. And then if he tries to summon a big boy, doesn't matter. You'll just um, you'll just reinforcements next turn, and get rid of it, whatever it may be. Mm-hmm. God, could you imagine if he doesn't play the exile force? Yeah, well, okay, that's pretty much one. game. Yeah, it's pretty much game. Summon the, <laughs> summon the Kaiku and attack. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> okay. Um... Wow. All right. So. Um... Yeah. And uh, yeah, get those out. Get in compulsories. Yeah. And. Nobleman's. Yeah, and get in, uh, yeah, uh, no, no, um, a tornado. Yeah, um, what are we getting rid of here? Oh, wait, how come he's got two widespread ruins, but only two sacrosis? What? Okay, whatever. Get rid of the bullet, oh, yeah. perhaps? Um, you don't really need the... I would say you don't really need another blade and uh, no, yeah, leave the blade. No, now. I agree. With that. Oh no, they get two K. I suppose. Yeah, they get two K. No, don't touch monsters. Uh, I think reduce your white spreads or your um compulsories just by one, or however many. Yeah. That is good. Okay, I put a zombie in. Nice. You need that bad yeah. boy. Let's go. Let's go. That was amazing. He's yeah. not going to be happy with this like first experiment. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is supposed to be an instructional video, and then we've both taken warriors. This is a sad state of affairs for <laughs> instructional games. I mean, what, what's what's he going to instruct people on? <laughs> yeah, I just got destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you lose yeah, very the, quickly. <laughs> yeah, the frustration of that. We need to like do go control mirrors or something. I think so. Yeah. Maybe for next episode. Mm -mm. First episode, <laughs> Warrior Mirror. <laughs> no one has fun. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. With tons of feedback, apparently, on my microphone. But that's fine. Ah, oh, he's going to have one massive um, dust, dust shoot. <sighs> Straight in. Okay, get your monster out quickly. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, he would have sided that out, wouldn't he, the dust shoot, so... No, because he's going first. Yeah, but... Anyway, just say everything. Let's go. Should I crash it? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Just end your turn. Well, that's one committed board. Wow, hey. Oh, that's unfortunate. He hit the worst one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. If he, like, flips to Kree somehow. Oh, oh, okay. What does he hit? That's fine. That hurts a little bit. Dun, 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 dun. Uh... God, it's actually been ages since I've played GOAT format. Yeah, it has like, been a while. <laughs> what about in real life as well? Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, I don't think we should judge that. Really. No, no, no. Just let him crash into it, and then you kill the other one. So allow the crash, and then uh, activate the, the Saku. Nice. Okay. Wow. Yeah, you've got the book. Might as well. Yeah, there's not much choice, is there? At least we got <laughs> rid of two of his blade knights. Yeah, and he most likely took out his noblemen's. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, 
I wonder if he Jurassic knows. Jurassic <laughs> Nine. <laughs> That hurts. You don't have a dark though. <laughs> I, I def he definitely knows I have one now though. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just look at his graveyard maybe to to throw him off. <laughs> ah, oh, no. it. Just book it. Book it. Book yeah, it. There's no choice. Nice. Okay. What do I need exactly right you now? Need a, you need a dark monster. And you need a ram into... Oh, jeepers, creepers. Okay, well, you're just going to have to hit it. <laughs> you're just going to have to kill that thing. And then activate the... Um, the the Yeah, the... No, 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 down. That, the judgment. Activate yeah. the judgment. You have to. Well, that's not good. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, God, this game. It's like this real chess kind of... <laughs> Uh, did you draw a monster? I'm ready. Uh, <laughs> okay, well that sucked. This, um, this is the worst duel ever. Um, uh, I think you're fine. If you you can do you yeah I think you could just. Well, we've got to at least like pretend we're siding, right? You know. I mean, yeah. You look. You theoretically should be putting in some. Um, Dust shoots. But I would rather have the traps to destroy the monsters rather than putting them back in his Look, deck. I am never a, even on the on the turn. I'm not a fan of having trap dust shoots. It's almost like yeah. guaranteeing you've got a dead card later on. Mm -hmm. That's just me. Yeah. But you know the rule is if you win. Um. Well, no, sorry. If you play against chaos warriors, you pretty linear anyway aren't you so yeah I've completely lost my trailer of thought in that sentence <laughs> um I think you should just charity yeah oh whoever goes we, we're first so we should win right we should um, um gee as creepers that sucks <laughs> yeah late night and uh, and uh Saku oh, okay I was going to say judgment. Nah, just keep the judgments. I'll just note anything. No, 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 no. Okay, Sorry. okay. Well. Uh, yeah, that's... I would get... Um, uh, that Donzaloon. Donzalug. And summon Don. And set everything, basically. Yeah, I mean... Again, there's like... Not much choice here. Um... <laughs> All right. God, I hate. I don't. I really suck at playing warriors. I don't like their playstyle at all. I'm very slow. Um. Ooh, he's thinking. Wow. That's interesting. Oh, that's a dust tornado. <laughs> oh, yeah, 100%. You can do it, though, when he... Okay. You can do it when he attacks, but that's fine. Doesn't matter. Nah. Don't matter. Uh, that you're going to ring when he attacks? Yeah, cool. Okay, are we getting a card from his hand? No. <laughs> uh, no, it's fine. Just let him do that. Okay, that's cool. That's good. That's it. That's an end of turn. Watch him draw Blade Knight. I'm just trying to think of what Lucas is saying on his end right now. This is fine. I like that play. <laughs> um. 
This is gonna be could potentially be a very very quick video. Uh, uh, get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Don't let that happen. <laughs> Just don't let that happen. Three one. Is he gonna stop? Ah, oh, he's not. Nice. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> so he's obviously analyzing every single possible card we have in our hand. He probably thinks we have a Magician of Faith set. And if it turns out that his perspective says that we have Magician of Faith set. That would be quite funny. <laughs> I'm wondering if he's cottoned onto what particular deck we're playing. Because this one plays, obviously, a lot of flips. Sit. Yeah. Okay, man. Okay. Oh, uh, interesting. That's fine. That's fine. Well, yeah, we can get rid of it with... Um, yeah, with the uh, XL. Or Blade Knight. Or Blade Knight. Oh, or well, Space MST. <laughs> um, MST, the, 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 the uh, what do we think? Well, I don't think we should MST the Call of the Haunted, personally. Yeah. I think so then MST, MST the face down on the left of the Call of the Haunted, I think. Just for a YOLO moment. Yeah, you always do this. and oh. Love it. I love oh. it, man. Just keep okay, things better guessing. Be, better be good. Oh, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, that was quite Oof. good. It wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh. Okay, what's he got? Blade Knight? Okay. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, it maybe has Zombira. No targets? <laughs> no, surely not. Okay, he must get Blade Knight, right? Yeah, I think Blade Knight or Exile. Something that's going to get rid of it. Oh, yeah, he's going to crash Zombira. Because yeah. right? then he's set up for chaos. If he Dude, runs that. Oh, man, you really need to draw a flipping Kaiku. This deck runs three, hey? But yet we're not seeing any of them. Summon, exile, attack yeah, 4,000, set the book, yeah. and end your turn. Okay, so, yeah. No, I, yeah. And then if he tries to kill it, we book it and... Yeah, book it. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's just no. Cool. Fine, it's perfect. <gasps> Amazing. Okay. Go. Oh, God, if he has torrential. Okay. Awesome. Get out of here. Uh, and the Blade Knight. Make sure the Blade Knight leaves it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cool. Nice. Turn. Oof, dude, that MST was so good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, book the XR. Yeah. Oh, God. Attack. Just attack. Don't flip anything. Don't flip anything. Fine. In turn. Oh man, that flipping top head. Oh head. no! Oh, <laughs> He's gonna win! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Alright. No, he's up and win. Huh? You good, you golden. I wouldn't Unless he top draws a flipping level swordsman, dude, that will be disgusting. <laughs> Come on, never spell our trap. Or, or if he... Oh, well, no, BLS doesn't even help him. Oh, okay. I feel like... <laughs> like I could have saved us. Charity. <laughs> With you? Yeah, no, just looking in your... In your graveyard, it's not going to make the uh, the other ones appear. All right. Let's, let's go. Let's, let's pray go. for something glorious. Yes, yes. <laughs> Amazing. That's a win. No, it's not. <laughs> not quite. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's not okay, what do you want to do here? I'm huh? thinking, I'm thinking... I'm thinking we get rid of the Zabora and the Sakuratsu. Zabora? Wait, no, no, what's the face on card that we have? Is it a, a dust tornado? Yeah, it is. Okay, I'm thinking Snatch and I think we get rid of the Zambara or whatever, the Dark and the Sakuratsu. Yeah. I think... Oh. Yeah. You can get rid of the book if you want to and then keep the Saku. As long as we keep this out of the grave. That's going to be on your side, so I think keep the book. Yes. No, I agree. Uh, yeah, no. Yeah, I'm, keep I'm the book. Board. Just, Let's go. Yes. Man, if only that that Zambara was any other monster. <laughs> Literally any other monster. Ugh. Okay. We gotta just keep this ninja alive. Yeah. Uh no. Destroy it. Destroy it. Yeah, get rid of that. I, well. When he attacks, when he yeah, attacks. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was gonna say I'm, I'm gonna wait. I swear to God, if this is if he tributes for like Mobius, I'm gonna be furious. <laughs> like something. Like, uh... If he tributes for Mobius, that'll be the most filthiest thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's analyzing. I don't know what right now. He is shitting himself. He must be. <laughs> like he can't. He can't win this now. No. Like he's got BLS right. in his hand, probably. Okay, cool. Get rid of that. Yeah. Boom. GG. Um, no, he doesn't have something for main phase two. Oh yeah, there we go. Yes. I'll see you Unfortunate. Oof. Okay. I do. Nice. Well, thank you for tuning in, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks guys. This is we... Jinzo and Tonic and Rost signing out. Yeah, we will play next time something better than Warriors. <laughs> Alright, hello guys, and welcome to a little bit different video. This time I'm going to play my good friend Rost, who is going to be co-piloting with their friend Jinso from the James and Tonic channel. And this was their suggestion. We're going to try and make a video out of this. I'm not quite sure how it's going to turn out or exactly what we're going to do with it. But here we are, and I'm supposed to record my point of view. And such I thought I might as well post my entire point of view as well. So I decided to queue up a quite standard warrior deck, trying out No Book of Moons, which has been popular recently. So I'm quite familiar with this deck, and I would appear when playing the Warrior Mirror, which is, you know, a positive seeing as I've just removed the Book of Moons, which are quite bad in the matchup. I think I should probably just summon Warrior Lady Pass. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to wait with this dust shoot until after the reinforcements of the army. Because quite frankly, there aren't that many monsters we can summon to punish me. I guess Donsalug is one, but it's more likely we're going to rota for Donsalug than I'm having the Donsalug naturally in their hand. And that's why I would have waited. As this played out, uh, that's not a concern. Actually, they left their Blade Knight dead to a Kaikure Sasuke. I would have thought for sure that that was a Secrets Armor or a Ring of Destruction. Very risky play from their side, but it seems to have worked out for them. So yeah, I take 49. Discard the Sasuke and this looks disastrous already for me. For back row, can't even play around dust shoot. I don't appear to have it though. Not that 
it really matters all that much. So what to do? I think I just have to summon the Kaiko and try to run over the dance look. I mean I could Yeah, I mean I'm just completely lost here. Not much to do. That was a misclick. Right, so I'll attack the dance look. But we we'll go for the solo judgment. Which looks like a poor play. Because now I have a light and a dark in my graveyard. But we're not going to be punished. So now what? I guess I set the rota because I don't want to discard it to the dance look. My only hope here is when playing around a mirror force, but it would appear we have the second judgment as well. So that's not going to be relevant. So what to do here? I have built my side deck with this matchup in mind. And I believe these are the seven cards I want. I do not want the dust shoots. I don't want the Mystic Swordsman and I do not want the Nobleman. And also I think the Don Salug is quite subpar. This does mean my reinforcements of the army can't grab a Dark Monster at command. But it's so narrow to grab a cliff for a Don Salug as is that I think I'm better off not running a dark target. So my side deck is designed to be able to side into triple secret armor, triple widespread rune. I think these cards are just the gold standard in this matchup. I also run dust tornadoes to complement these, but that's mostly because we're also quite good against decks running gravity bina, level limit area B. Alright, let's see here. Do I want a Gracefall? I think so, right? Yeah. Okay. Not quite sure how to play this because I do want to get value out of the Heavy Storm. You could argue that I should just discard the Storm, discard the Sasuke, and set 4. I think I like that. Actually, yeah, I'm not sure if this is correct, but we're making a video. I'm not going to think for a minute to make sure I make the optimal decision. I think this looks fine. So if I have the storm, then I'm going to have the judgment, which is unfortunate, but I think fine. Yeah, that's fine. So I wonder if we're going to dare to attack here. Their hand looks real good. Yeah. So do I want to blind these? I think I probably do. Book is still in the deck. That's a bit weird. Alright. So there is both Torrential Tribute and Mirror Force to worry about. I think I'm just going to play into the Mirror Force. Not completely sure. Because I want to Empty my hand. Obviously, Torrential Tribute is not a worry. It's just generally those are the cards you should consider when deciding whether or not to extend onto the field. It would appear we didn't have Mirror Force, so my gamble seems to have paid off here. Now. It would appear we have something that cares about the grave. 
could that be a magician of faith? I don't know. Either way, I'm going to summon the Kaiko here and just attack. I don't think there's any relevance in trying to play around the Morphing Jar. Better off just... Uh, what's the word? Representing a Black Luster Soldier so that, let's say they Saku, I can go BLS. And maybe that discourages them from Sakuing. Obviously, extremely extremely marginal, but I don't think they're ever running more from Jarsa. Just... So, that's likely a book. I think I'm in a really good spot here, especially if the Skyku gets to connect. Wow, the book. Very interesting. Personally, I'm not really a fan of siding into flips in the warrior mirror i tried it when on the play but even then i think it's quite marginal definitely ringing that let's see if we get into judgment war because i'm going to take them up on it okay so we're both down to 2000 so, ring is going to be scary for no one. But I'm in a really good spot here. And uh, this card is very unlikely to be Mirror Force, as it wasn't flipped. Onto my attack with the double blade knight previously. So, I think that was a nice game. Magician of Faith was not impressive as we didn't draw any Trinity. And Book definitely didn't impress either. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to change anything. Yeah, no. I, I don't think the faith is enough for me to include a nobleman or a mystic swordsman. The blade knights will have to be sufficient. Starting hand is not great. Kaiko and uh, Grandmaster Sasuke are close to being filler in these matchups. Blade Knight is the gold standard. And whenever people go down below, triple Blade Knight, because oh, it never connects. Well, sometimes it does connect with a flip monster and that's just a huge blowout and also it's your best monster in these warrior mirrors as well so i don't think you should ever play less than three of the blade knight rota for don salug i suppose we're going to set to do the war later then no summon don salug pass wow my hand is quiet well equipped for this. I think I'm going to lead with the snatch. Maybe not. So if I connect with the Kaiku, I get to banish the Blade Knight. If I snatch and we book the Dawn, and then I connect with the Kaiku. I don't get to banish the Blade Knight and they could have Chaos. But I have a Kaiku in play, so that's not an issue really. So yeah, I think I'm going to lead with the Snatch still. Very unlikely to resolve, of course, but... You could argue I should save it. That might be correct. I don't know. I like playing simple. So, I'll go with the Kaiku. Try to prompt a removal spell. There we go, there's a ring. Which does signal that we're unlikely to have any battle traps. Useful information. Alright, and I'm going to set all these back row and pass. So we're on the play, and thus we're going to be up a card on the draw. 
that's interesting yep I don't want to blind the dust tornado into an MST or a dust tornado of their own. You could argue that they would have used them though. Quite frankly, I'm not that worried about their flip monster surviving. Wow, solemn judgment. I don't understand that. That's very interesting. So why would they do that? Could be because we have a chaos monster in hand and the back row can't deal with the kaiku. So what does that make the back row? I don't know. It could be a dust tornado or an MST, but I think I'm gonna risk it here. But I mean, their set monster is so likely going to be a Magician of Faith, because if it's a Deer War later, why would they solemn the Kaiku, right? Very confusing. Maybe at that point I should just go for the call without using the dust tornado. Sure. What's the Koichi? I don't really get it. Okay, we're in a good spot. This also does give me some value out of their call before a heavy storm is played, which could have been playing into why they flip the judgment so aggressively. I wonder what that set card is. We decided to blind the MST. Just a bit weird to me. I mean, we definitely hit the right one. Because, man, my dust tornado would have destroyed one there. So they won that 50 50, and that might have been uh, decisive actually. I'm going to dust now. Because there's nothing to chain. Yeah. Alright. Use the Rota. I'm not sure if I should get a Exile Force or Blade Knight. I guess a Blade Knight because I want the light. And they already have a light, right? Yeah. So yeah, I'll grab the Blade Knight. And we're going to trade. So let's see. I'm in a bad spot here. But that's not a strong play. That's a very weak play, even. That, on the other hand, is a strong play. Whoa. I took a thousand too much there. That was a misclick on my part. So now my chaos monsters aren't live, which is very unfortunate. I'm going to use the Destiner now, so that my mirror force doesn't get hit. And now I'm gonna pass. Wow. So let's see if I can run the Excel Force over. Nice. Okay. If I have Snatch, this is bad, of course. But we wouldn't set the Snatch because it's better to hold on to. Because the Link would do is not really something we should care about at this point. So now I'm thinking that their set card is likely the back row that is. A Dust Nerado, an MST.
let's see what happens after I attack. Yeah, that's bad for me. It actually, it could be a delinquent though. That's possible. I'm so likely to just die here, but you know, I don't have any options, so not much to do. I'm really confused by them uh, using judgment onto my Kaiko earlier. Seemed so weird to me. I mean, we must have a game shot here, right? Wow, discard some Bira. Their hand must be good. So I guess we have like Blade Knight and a uh, back row. Deciding so which back row to keep, perhaps. But if I get the new, tr yeah. So we did have the snatch. Oh, but we didn't have anything that could um, finish me off. That's quite nice for me. So I don't have any light. So my only play is to premature for the kaiku and attempt to crash. Let's see here. So I decided to keep something over the Socrates armor. I don't know what that would be though. Should I attack or not? It's so hard to say. I have no idea. I mean it could be Mirror Force, but why the pause? Why did we think? We wouldn't think if it was a Mirror Force. I can't really come up with a card it could be where I win. So yeah, I just died here. That was a nice game though. Had fun. GG. So let's see if... Uh, what we want to do here. Yeah, that, w that was a good match. I think it showcased how the warrior matchup often plays out. Just a bunch of trades. Alright, it would appear we're good. Uh, thanks to Ross and Jinso for playing me. And uh, thanks to you who's watching this video.